Hannigan had a look, but uh, oh, yellow, side red down. flag. Car upside down in turn number one. Brian, Brian Parker, Parker getting upside down, down in turn number one to bring out the red flag. Come off of turn four, we get set to go to the green. Green flag is out, 20 laps of distance, Bud Canning, the Silver Crown points leader. Your leader now, here comes Herrera to the top spot. Slide chop, he'll take him, and Katie battles back. Well, the three wide back in the pack, and now towards the front, they sort him out, going toward turn number three, the battle in the third spot. Here comes Randy Hannigan to the inside. Hannigan takes third, now Shane Stewart to challenge for fourth. Shane Stewart elbows up on that rock star, 57 up to fourth, he'll pull the slider, take it in turn number two. Now he's got his sights set on Bud Kading as Kading goes right about two car lengths back of Hannigan into turn number three. Johnny Herrera, the race leader, the car number 45X. Randy Hannigan running second. Now the car number 1X of Bud Kading running third. Here comes Shane Stewart. Shane Stewart down to the inside. Slide job coming up. He's got it in turn number three. And Johnny Herrera sees the lap cars as he goes by the school up flag stand. Randy Hannigan trying to hold on to the second spot. Now Sammy Swindell going for the fourth spot. He nearly gets to go. Oh, they nearly touch in turn two. Oh, Dr. Sammy Swindell and Bud Caney coming oh so close. Now Sammy looks again for the slider. He'll take fourth in turn number four. Sammy Swindell is on the hammer. Elbows up trying to make it happen. Good battle. Now Shane Stewart. He moves by Hannigan for second. Here comes Randy Hannigan back to the inside. Oh, my. What a race to the second spot. White flag, one to go this time. Who's it going to be? Look at Stewart right on the back bumper. Pushing him down the front straightaway as the white flag flies. Oh, Shane Stewart bucks the cushion, takes the lead. Here comes Johnny Herrera back to the inside, down the back straightaway, side by side for the lead in turn three. Coming for the checker, three wide with the lap cars. Stewart's got the tough side. He'll take the lead as Herrera gets over the cushion. Shane Stewart with the last sweat pass to victory lane. Push fans one more time, Shane Stewart. Shane talked to you earlier in the grandstands, it was wishful, it was hopeful, and all you needed was some lap traffic tonight. Oh man, uh, I can't thank uh, Rockstar, Lucas Oil, ART chassis is really good, the Westmar engines ran great. Uh, I've got a little past history with Randy Hennigan, so I wanted to make sure I raced him clean. And you know, Johnny and I, we've raced a long time, and uh, yeah, you're exactly right, I needed lap cars, I needed for him to slow down a little bit. And, I tried to run the bottom a couple times, and Hannigan was actually pretty good down there, and I just wasn't very good. So, uh, you know, lap cars just kind of played in my favor tonight. And we needed those points, you know, to, uh, like I told you earlier, I think you're going to have to start in the front two rows to win tomorrow night. So, uh, I can't thank my guys enough. Paul, he, uh, he works his tail off. Thank you, Johnny. He works his tail off. Corey, Hindu. Uh, I got a great crew. My, my wife's here. Uh, she don't ever get to see me race, so. It's a big win to, uh, to uh, win in front of her, so we'll uh, take this in tomorrow, and hopefully we can put the Rockstar car back in victory lane and carry the momentum into the 410 Nationals. All right, buddy, congratulations. Thank you. Race fans, one more time, give it up. Tonight, the second night of the Earl Supply, 360 Nationals goes to Shane Stewart. If you are not a regular, we need the bracket also.